Hello, my name is Toby Rowland, and I'm the CEO of Mangahai.com, the uh, this next generation math game-based learning site. So uh, we launched this company in October of this year, and what we're doing is creating games that are in incredibly playable, that kids can love, and which also teach mathematics at a very high level. So the games are very challenging. They're targeted mainly at uh, kids 8 to 16 years old. And they draw on my experience as being the CEO of King.com, where I uh, hosted about 5 billion games plays over the last uh, five years. So what I did was I tried to take that experience and turn them into games. And I think you can see here on screen a game called Pyramid Panic, which we made to uh, help kids to learn their geometry lessons. Now, what you're doing is... Uh, Actually, I'm going to restart this game so you can see it right from the beginning, yeah? So, uh, now I'm going to start it right from the start. Okay, this is our most popular game. Um, it's called Pyramid Panic. It's a geometry game. You play a mummy who has to try and escape from a pyramid. And there's your mummy. What you're doing is trying to find a red line up here that matches the red line in front of your mummy and, uh, and drag it down onto place to build a path. The game goes from area of a square through ribbon of a kite, circles, uh, through to Pythagoras now. Um, and, uh, and here you've got some various enemies you've got you to take care of. And you're being followed by Amit. And it goes on to trigonometry. So this game is very, very difficult. I'm going to show you another game now. Uh, okay. But to summarize it, can you say that you're taking social gaming on the next level to really educational gaming? What we're taking from social gaming is the aspect of competition. We really believe in controlled competition is, is incredibly powerful at uh, getting kids to, comp to work hard and do their maths. So for instance, what we have here is a real high school game. This is called Flower Power. It starts nice and easily. So what you're doing, trying to do here is order uh, large blooms at the top, small blooms at the bottom. Starts very simple. We completed this flower, that's great. And now we've got to wait for this bee to pollinate it. It's going to make more difficult flowers. Suddenly, oh my gosh, we have a fraction. Okay, if we get this, frac if we get this tulip right, which is uh, quarters and halves, then things are going to get even worse. Look at these roses. So tricky. And you have to be fast. You've got to be super fast. Now what's happening here is the kids are doing up to a hundred different mathematical operations, in this case ordering, every 10 minutes. So this is more effective than any worksheet you could possibly imagine. This, this is what we believe is the future of mathematics. So how did you come up with the idea to start educational games? Well, what I noticed when I was uh, running King.com was that the games in themselves weren't that interesting. What was exciting was competition and high scores. So I, th I said, okay, we can make exciting games about mathematics and uh, we can, um, uh, and, and kids will want to play them. Tell me about the market. Uh, schools are online now. That I, I believe that 100% and I see huge numbers of searches for, um, for math related topics on the internet. So that's the market we're going after. Schools that have really good ICT facilities and are ready to uh, to adopt this kind of technology. So what's your business model? Um, the, the games are free to play, but if you want to see how the students are performing, then we ask for a subscription fee. But I think all schools will find that this is an incredible free resource. Okay, so what are your plans for the upcoming year? Uh, we're going to launch a math games league, which is going to be incredible, and, uh, and we hope that all the schools in the world will compete. And funding? Uh, funding is, is from myself, really. It's a tough funding market. And so I, I use, I'm using uh, my funds from King.com to, uh, to support this. What do you think about the conference or what, uh, the exhibition here? A lot of uh, interesting people from all around the world have come today. And uh, you know, it, it's, it's been great to talk to those people on the stand. A lot of people from Scandinavia in particular. Do you have competitors? Maybe they are even here? We are the first company offering uh, game-based math at this level. Yeah, I wish you a lot of success with your company. Brilliant. Well, thank you for coming by.